today I'm gonna show you how to do the green camo skull. Haley, another skull. Really? This will be the last color of the three, and I swear this will be the last skull makeup for a while. I'm sure you guys are sick of my skulls by now. So enough horsing around, let's jump right into the video and let's get started. I'm not gonna get too far into the details on how to do the camo skull because I already have two videos on how to do it. In fact, I wasn't even gonna do a tutorial on this one. I was gonna do a time lapse, but there's a couple different steps on how to do this one. So I will go through those. I'm gonna focus more on how to do this specific skull. Our first step as always is sketch out the skull features. Prime your eyeballs, and I took the lightest green I could find and just went ham with it. I just slapped it all over my eyelid. Don't be afraid to be aggressive with it. Then I used a medium green shadow and I made a line on my crease. And then I smoothed things over with that medium green with a fluffy brush. And on my eyelid, I made a base with the NYX Jumbo Eye Pencil and Black Bean. I smoothed it out with my finger and put a dark green on top. What do you get when you add black and dark green? A darker green. And now we're gonna get into painting the camo part. I'm gonna use the same method as I have been for the other two videos, so I'm not gonna get too much into it. What do you want from me, people? So yeah, the colors I basically use for this one is lime green, a darker green, brown, gold, and then just a little bit of black. And I guess the ratio I would put would be 50% lime, 30% like darker green, 20% brown, 10% gold, and 2% black, just a little bit of black. I don't know what percentage that, that adds up to, but you get the idea. So yeah, the rest of everything else is the same steps as before, so just follow those and you're golden. Hey, I'll give you guys bonus points if you can find the sea turtle on my face. Your prize will be my acknowledgement. I didn't put too much gold on my face because I wanted to be rare and exotic, I think. One thing I did differently than the other looks was that I added black on top of the other colors to add more layers. This will make it look more like camouflage, especially since it's green. And the squigglies for the black is a lot skinnier than the other colors.
<laughs> you can see Diamond in the background too. Diamond! You can see her right, right there. Your eyes look even bigger on camera. That's saying something. <laughs>